In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Snapchat device ban in 2025. So these bans are often indicated by error codes like SS06 or SS07, and that means that Snapchat has restricted your device from accessing the app due to violations of their community guidelines or terms of service. So here are some things that you guys could do in order to potentially fix this issue. So number one is to always understand why you got banned in the first place. That's the first thing you want to do before you do anything else, understand why you're even banned. So please go ahead and check for notifications or emails informing you of the exact reason. So there's a temporary ban right over here that typically lasts between 24 hours to at maximum 30 days. And after that time period passes, you may regain access after waiting out the ban period. So yeah, if you have like a temporary ban, then obviously the best thing that you guys could do at that point is just to wait it out a little bit. However, if you got a permanent device ban, which is the error code SS06 or SS07, your device's unique identifier is blacklisted and this is going to prevent logins or new account creations on that device these bans are a little bit harder to actually resolve but regardless of what type of ban you got the first thing that you guys should do is to submit an appeal snapchat's official stance is that the only legitimate way to address a device ban is through their appeal process so let's go ahead and do this really quickly so open up the snapchat app and then go ahead and log in so if you recently got banned and you open up your snapchat application then chances are you might see a pop-up that says appeal decision and then from there you're able to go ahead and submit an appeal however if you do not see it then what you can do is just open up any web browser and then just look up snapchat support right over here and basically and then you want to scroll down to where it says managing my account and you want to select on my account is locked so please go ahead and press on that and then from there you're able to talk to a representative and basically you want to submit an appeal process and whenever you're submitting an appeal process you always want to be respectful in your appeal and also you need to be concise and professional if possible try to like state you know examples of their terms of service and explain why your actions actually comply with the terms of service so i know it it's a little bit inconvenient, but this is hands down the most reliable way to get a Snapchat ban fixed. What you guys could also do is use a different device. So if a ban is device specific, what you could try doing is using an entire new device entirely with a different email and stuff like that, basically creating a new Snapchat account and then using it from there. But if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.